Well, smack my ass and shave my balls. It's the best damn podcast from Chippewa Falls. Maybe yeah. tongue punched the turd cutter. Oh, oh my God. Fort box. You Fort dumb box. dink. Tongue- Good morning, <laughs> all you hick guys and gals. You scared me. This- <laughs> <laughs> we are Tales from the Hicks, and who have we got with us today? Hey, I'm Jason. And I'm Chad. BDC in the house. <laughs> this is Ben. And I am Nate. Chad. Hi. Tell us what is going on outside. Oh, you know, the answer is to BDC. Um, <laughs> yeah. BDC. It's currently sprinkles. Sprinkles. Um, currently. Yeah, I like them mm. on my cake. Yep. My um, donut. Ice cream. To yeah. go with Ooh. the sprinkles is 66 degrees. Ooh. It's chilly. 11 it's chilly. MPHs coming from the west. Fucking mm. gorgeous. Yeah. yeah. Gorgeous. But uh, that's the temperature today and wind and it's, uh, just how it is. Seems kind of chilly for this time of year. Well, they really cooled if, off. I wondered if Jason would have a stocking hat on when I got here today. Yeah. I knew he would have the sweaty. I knew he'd have the hoodie on. Right. Well, I wondered. I debated between hoodie and Columbia coat or both. <laughs> Might need to borrow my red <clears throat> Loken jacket. Yeah. Do you have a coat in the truck already? No. Oh, okay. Mm-mm. I don't believe you. I got blankets. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was to say, I can't believe a, a jacket doesn't just live in your truck. <clears throat> I got a furnace in there. A furnace? I in your truck? On the red? Oh. Yep. Mm. Yeah, gets hot. Oh, yeah. Didn't mom ever teach you to carry, like, gloves and boots and socks and all the extras just in case? She had to teach them because she still carries them for you. <laughs> so she couldn't do it for two kids. <laughs> and, I mean, it's <laughs> probably a tote you can take out this time of year. Oh. I mean, I'm not sure. Well, I'm not sure this rain's going to turn into sleet or anything. We don't know that. You're not a fucking weatherman. I'm not, but I would bet a lot it's not going to. You play one on a podcast. Yeah, once or twice. Well, I'd say about 23, 24. Ooh, that, oh. Is that what it is? That's yeah, what we're up to now? Yeah, we're Sheesh. in the 20s something. 20 something. And we're still going. I'll tell you, I still look forward to it every week. Yeah, yeah. no, it's enjoyable so still. So do seven other people. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Hey. That's yeah. we do it for them. That's what we do yeah, it for. All seven. Yep. yep. One, two, three more. Yep. Three more people. <laughs> yeah. Appreciate right, it. So Appreciate I know it. my mom and Dan watch. Yeah, yeah that's too. Yeah, but that's by guilt. The yeah. skeeters still listen. <laughs> they don't enjoy. it. They when he gets, you to. know, when he figures out. Oh yeah, because he. Oh yeah, he's fucking busy. Oh my god, that guy is just <laughs> yeah, swamped. swamped. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> busy. Speaking of even busy and swamped, Chad, what did you do this week? Ah. Uh, well, my boss was gone, so um, fucked off. Mm. I wish that was the case. In a, a lot of other jobs, you probably could. You know, you get away with a little bit of it. Uh, this was the complete opposite because mm. um, there's only like one and a half of us that know what to do, and he's not there. So uh, for that department, I'll make that clear. Not Are you the, the half? shop? No, I'm actually the one. Oh, um, and it, so it was just. Uh, an opportunity to work a lot of overtime this week. Um, I think I had 59 hours. Nice. Uh, yeah. I mean, it will be nice, but it's, you know, early, early in the morning and stay late in the afternoon. It's, and it's tough to force yourself it. to do it. It's nice when you get the paycheck, but yeah, it's Other, hard to make yourself do it. Otherwise than that. Um, so what you were saying, like anything over 40 hours, you got paid time and a half. Oh, for, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that must be nice. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it is. But I, I would imagine I would. <laughs> you don't even hit 40. I, yeah, I would imagine. Let's talk about this lunch break yeah. we were discussing earlier. <laughs> yeah. Christ, and I think I'll swap my time and a half for your salary yeah. if you want. Tell you what, we'll swap checks next week. Does that work? I don't get paid next week. So okay, sure. how about the following week? <laughs> no, I just got paid today. Well, yeah, today yep, today we got, we got paid all of us. Well, I did too. And mm. It happens to be the same day as you. But I actually get mine on Wednesdays. My check comes in on two days before. Payday. Really? Yeah. Mine shows up on Thursday night, but it doesn't affect a, You can't pull it out until Friday. Mm, so. Never pull out. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, otherwise than that, um, uh, <laughs> went with Brielle and her mom to pick up Brielle's car that she bought. So She has a car now. She does. What, what is get? it? It's a 2014 Ford. Jesus. 
Ford. Yeah. Uh, Focus. No. Fusion. Explorer. No. Excursion. Escape. 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 There it is. Yeah. White in color. Oh, that's Ooh. like a mini. Or a, uh, it's like a small SUV. SUV. Yeah. yeah, small. Um, yeah. A guy like myself. Boy, it looks weird. It's not meant for big people. Hmm. So, yeah, she got that, and then a couple things the guy's going to fix on it for her, part of the deal kind of thing, and and she hopefully will start to drive a lot more than once a week. But All right. Oh, well, yeah, she, not, she drove out here last Friday. She did. Did she yeah. have her vehicle then? No. No. We picked it up Monday. Monday. Monday night. Right. Monday or Tuesday? It was either Monday night or Tuesday night, I remember. But, yeah, no, she so she drives mine, and that makes her look tiny yeah. in it, <laughs> but... She seems she seems excited now that she's got something and but that was it. Nice. Cool. Ben, ben tell us about your week. Well, nothing <clears throat> nothing real crazy. My boy had his last um baseball game of the year. <clears throat> Excuse me. Last baseball game of the year, so that was cool and then they gave out medals to all the kids and the like the mascot from the Miracle League was there and they did pictures with everybody and yeah, it was cool. Other than that, just worked, and that was about it. And I was going to try to come down there yeah. this week. Oh, no big deal. But it was, and I'll get to it later, but it was National Night Out. So I don't oh, know. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, did he? <laughs> yeah, it's going to be funny. <laughs> he came out of the closet. Oh. No. Uh, you know, Chad thought National you... Night Out was something else. <laughs> it's lies. Uh, did he enjoy it like do you think he'll do it next year well i if we sign him up yeah, yeah. i mean i don't i <clears throat> i think he enjoyed it so i don't know it's cool yeah, yeah it's Looks a good, good ex- oh i was gonna say <clears throat> i almost had to call you on wednesday night i think it was yeah i was available for some electrical assistance Ooh, busy I was uh, <laughs> now you're busy. Just kidding. I was making I was making dinner. I had some tri tip that I had made, and I was reheating that in the microwave. And then I was had some toast in our air fryer toasting, and all of a sudden we lost the microwave in the air fryer. Sure, gone. I was like, huh. None of the lights in the kitchen went out, and the air fryer is plugged into the socket that's like to the right of our <laughs> microwave. <clears throat> and the microwave is built in, you know, so that you can't even see the outlet that it's plugged Correct. into. And I was like, well, none of the other things went out in the kitchen. Interesting. Maybe these two things, maybe these two outlets are on a breaker all by themselves. And we've had it happen before upstairs where my boy loses power in his room and none of the breakers trip. But if you go into the bathroom upstairs, the GFI outlet mm, is tripped. Trip, sure. And then that brings the power back. So I'm like, I was fucking with the outlets in the kitchen thinking maybe one of these outlets was tripped. No. Nope. So go downstairs, check all the breakers. None of them are tripped. Uh, nothing. I'm like, well, all right. So I fire up the stove and I'm reheating the steak, whatever. Wife and the boy get home and Chris is like, well, did you try the breakers? I'm all. And I said, no, I just did the ones for the kitchen. Those things are for shit. I'm like, well, yeah, they are. Most of the time. And... Um, she went into the there are out of space in your breaker box so if you take the panel off there's a good chance that they're separately fed yeah but they're wire nutted together under the same breaker oh, okay uh, which we can get away with and take that out and you just put a slim breaker in there and they yep. each be on their own or they during remodel just the simplest fastest way was oh we'll just jump off of that you know yep. you're not going to be in the bathroom and shower or you know kitchen at the same time Get it up and i was like oh, i'll just i'll nuke it quick and yeah i was making toast to go along with dinner and yeah because i'm actually most the uh, code um the microwave should be on its very own dedicated 20 amp circuit yeah but well, apparently not mine's not well someday if you remodel or you know shit happens we'll yeah. figure it out or i'll just pull the panel off and we'll see if the easy fix i just won't run them together oh don't do that yeah yeah, yeah. But if you ever do need help, make sure you got something cooking when I come down. Yeah, I can. You know that I'm not really a fisherman. Yeah, well, well man, this isn't a fishing story. <laughs> Wait, you're not? This is an efficient story. I brought some string for you in case you needed string. to practice tying knots. Right. <laughs> I thought you were going to so, bring the yarn. Well, you know. But, like, okay, so when you went down to check your breakers, don't they, like, 
flip like you can see one that's off ours doesn't have the little window where it like clicks to the red and all of them were on the same side oh. like none of them had flipped Flip to the because that's what yeah. i would have looked at i'd be like no they're all fine I, I did too but i know from experience at our house that of them are tripped sometimes if you click it back and forth that resets it yeah. our breaker boxes mm. like yeah most breaker boxes that i've seen has the little window right and when it's flipped like even though the the switch may not flip the little red thing is there or else they're kicked over to the other side hmm. ours that's, is neither that's all depends on what kind of breakers you have though yeah. uh brand more so than others some brands don't even know that's not an option it's just how they do it yep you know if that would have been me i would have just been like oh i guess sell sell house cause. call doordash <laughs> <laughs> Hey, microwave's not working. <laughs> Give me some dominoes. Yeah, there it is. Well, yeah, because they have to be DoorDash. No, he'd have to here. go pick it up. No. Oh. Well, I don't know if DoorDash does dominoes. I'd have to look, but hmm. no. Hmm. They come here a lot. <laughs> I get Chipotle a lot. I get Fortune Cookie. I get Hardee's I had the other day. Yeah. That shit's lot. all got to be just stone cold by the time it gets here. Uh-uh. Not too bad. Huh. It's only, let's say, like 10 minutes, usually. i seen that off a bag on her front door and took yeah. off, and I'm like, what the fuck? But That's what you did this week? Yeah, cut grass. Yeah, what have, you been, what have you been up to this week? Oh, nothing. I was just working and cut grass yesterday. Now, when you say... <laughs> I cut grass. No, I know what that means. Uh, when you say across the street, isn't that a field? I was gonna no, say. the other street to the south. Oh, there, that lady down there, brickish house. Yeah. No, not the one just... Next, okay. Toward, right on the corner, across the... Oh, okay, sure, sure. Down the road. That one. Yeah, down now the road. I know. I the, thought, down the road. The corner. Corner. I thought, I mean, I haven't been to your house in a few weeks or months, but Chad, they really put up a house quick. See, out here in the country, across the street can mean yeah. know, half a mile away. A country, oh. a country block. Out here in the country. 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 <laughs> oh, if you could throw a baseball and hit your neighbor's house, you don't live in the country. <laughs> yep. Uh, don't do that, Nate. Where I'm at right now, I probably don't. couldn't. Don't so your I... parents don't live in the country? They couldn't. You couldn't hit a baseball. That's, right. That's Looking at I the thought. house right on the right. If you're standing at my parents' house, you could hit that with a baseball from their house. Yeah. No. Pretty sure that he's got the shed in the back. The house is up front, and you go... Except if you stood on the property edge, I would say... You don't like... No. Oh. They moved, I think. Well, the one died. that let him get the... <clears throat> one died, one moved. He lived one more down, oh. and I don't think he lives there anymore. Well, I, oh. could, I could hit that house. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe that just I, adds to the things we got to do. I think it from their house. Like, if you stood on their front porch, you couldn't hit his house. Throwing or hitting? Throwing. Yeah. I don't think... Steve and Shelby, I don't know what you're doing later, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Do not panic. Uh, you, you don't know, have to come out if you don't not, want to. You're not are, talking to them because they, uh, they don't listen. They don't listen? No. Okay. Oh, what? what the hell? Well, in case somebody They're informs like, what's them. a podcast? Uh-huh. So that's a new challenge. Because yeah. yeah. I used to mow that guy's next door, that lawn. Really? Uh, yeah. The gutter what? guy? Nope. The people before the gutter guy. Stephen Dolores Hayes? Oh, no. Ray and Mary. I don't know. They ended up moving away, and then I think he died. Elderly couple. Yep. Yeah, Ray and Mary. Yeah, yep. that I believe. Yeah. Yeah. They were super nice. I actually, they offered me an opportunity to buy that. Yeah. Do they have a red roof? Yeah, a yep. red building, yep. for sure. But I, at the time, I couldn't swing her, but I wanted no. it so bad. Just because, A. You can he, hit that. You'd have to uh, the chair. Who'd go no. through her? The fuck, you can't. Yeah. Not from their house to his house. We'll find out. Is that there? Maybe that's there. We'll anyway. do it in the cover of darkness tonight. <laughs> and just listen. I would not <laughs> recommend that. <laughs> oh, no. From get personal that, experience. Yeah, that click of the 49. Uh-huh. Coming out. <laughs> <laughs> fucking whitey tighties and a shotgun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Big, the big hog is hanging. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me. Go on down here. Clean up that aisle for uh, Light will just shit his pants. <laughs> <laughs> mm. uh, Nate, what'd you do then? Well, 
So Don't I'm dash. coming up. No, Monday I had no no. I want the world to this know. Is, no, see, I actually went because I, all right. <laughs> yeah, because you right. thought it was. There. Here we go. You here really thought it, it was it. Here, here it is. we go. I hope everybody's sitting down. Here wow. we go. God, I hope so. It's Tuesday story. night was National Night Out, and okay. as I was gonna say, I knew it was a police event. Because working at the courthouse, I understand I, you know, we get notification of that Chad on the until he thought it was, or until he realized it was a cop event. Okay, he I, thought it was a different coming out event. Yeah, I told you to delete that text <clears throat> message. I did, but not yeah, in. Well, I didn't delete the text message. Next time, text message in my brain. Oh, okay. Well, when you know when you send him the picture of you and uh, either either response, his his response would have been Is that me. <laughs> I think someone has time to get up or alarm or mm. is your dryer done? Sorry, I thought I had it muted. Get people. Hang on. You know how Let to mute that? Checking the Hollywood. specs on the end line rotary girder. Oh, Let's see what's going on. Everybody arrived at home safe and sound. Good. Uh, Good. Well, you, you got, you got you Life sixty on there or what? Mm-hmm. Do you? Yeah. What? Another app. Jason oh, has two apps on his phone. Uh, get rid of that one, fucking stupid holy thing. Holy shit. I don't need that bullshit. I'm called the stalker. I'm pretty hmm. sure it's off now. Because okay. you can turn it off on your own phone. Okay. Um, only if you're like an account holder or you're authorized. Like if the kid, the kids wouldn't have been able to turn it off on their own phone. For sure. Because that would kind of defeat the yeah, purpose. Yeah, I think they can shut the yeah, location off. I would agree off. with Nate on that. Yeah, but I think it's... but Because they, they are notified. They, they can do it, but then I think it notifies the... As in this case, yeah, her, her parental, that, yeah, pretty, pretty sure, hmm. or that, or they thought they were, and they actually never were. See, so, we have a rule with the kids. If I call or text, they're fucking answering right quickly, because if not, daddy's going to be showing up. And it's but what if Tanner's nice. making statue socks? Yeah, he better be putting the sock what down. What if he's and a suicide wing? Then well, yeah, he turns he into can't a put it down. It's standing straight up. Well, what if he's doing the part? What was that? Better, better hope he only needs one hand. <laughs> right. What's that one thing that they're doing out in California? The cool kids. What? <laughs> you know, like soaking, the, soaking, oh, yeah. soaking. What if you soak? <laughs> That's a little further north, but yeah, you were on the right coast. <laughs> Wasn't it California? Idaho. It's oh, like yeah. yeah, it's up. Oh, north. I thought it was. <clears throat> anyway, Utah. Yeah, that's okay. I thought it was California. Well, if he's soaking, his hands would be free. That's true. Um, he's got free time. Yeah, he's not even doing it unless he's the one moving to bed and somebody else is soaking. What a friend. Then hands what are occupied. Friend. That's probably what it is. <laughs> he's a good friend. Yeah. God, what a good. He's friend. got. He's got his buddy's back. Yeah. <laughs> you saying, wouldn't help your buddy. <laughs> all I'm saying is, when we text him or call, they better. Can he answer. put it on speakerphone so he can make sure his, his buddy doesn't miss a stroke? As long as they answer. Okay. All right. Do you give them? Since you brought it up, do you give them a, a time? Like, I mean, because you as a person or me or anybody else or at a buddy's place, you don't give them like a 10-minute return call? Nope. What if you're dropping the kids off at the pool and they don't have their phone on them? Who doesn't have their phone in the bathroom? You've never set your phone down? I usually just... don't take my phone in the bathroom. What? So it's got to be instant or you're all up and fucking I, I start, in a I start Listen, Chad, cigarettes. they could be getting their fucking hair dyed. <laughs> They could have. Oh, what? Fuck. Next thing you know, they're in prison. <laughs> See? That's that's the uh, debate at my place. Yep. Not prison. Kaylee's knocked up. Tanner's <laughs> in fucking prison. <laughs> All because you wanted to dye your motherfucking hair. <laughs> yeah. And, and then you killed 17 people. Ooh. Get the fuck out Ooh, of here. Ooh, 17. That's yep. Wild. That's what happens. Yeah. Happened she in Colorado. Belly- yep. Oh, is that the Taylor Swift thing that going down, or is that? Uh, I don't think they actually hurt anybody there. No, mm. and they arrested I, like three teenagers. No, there? Colorado was the uh, the theater Colorado guy. Theater oh, guy. Yeah, theater yeah. one. He had purple hair or something. The, yeah, was it Batman yeah. or red. during. Uh, I thought it was red. The Joker, orange. Or Batman. Maybe it was or orange. Orange, yeah. Orange hair. That's how it starts. Yeah. <laughs> I know. That's <laughs> why it ain't happening at my house. <laughs> well, I yeah, think, no, I just, I mean, people yeah, call I can't me. I don't give them like a little. Yeah, I mean. When I call you, if you don't answer, I want to call back in 15 minutes. Yeah, like minimum 10, 10, 15 minutes, you better be calling back. Yes, sir. That's what it is. 10, 15 minutes. Or sooner. Well, okay. Well, Well, that's that's reasonable. Yeah, that's That's, right. That's fair. I mean, watching a movie or a video game or... 
They want to know what they're doing. Yeah. Fuck you doing. <laughs> I'm watching you on my phone right here. <laughs> what are you doing? What are, what are you doing? That church, he can't call back. What is that church? Yeah. The Lord would strike down. Mm-hmm. Well, I know when he's at church. So you don't bother. Well, you check on them. You check and see, you see yeah. his location. No, oh, he's, he's, he's out with the Lord. Okay, so that goes into my next question. Sure. Have you been told? And so, we're back. On the count of three. You want all three of us to answer together on the count of three. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, what the question is, if Good, we forgot what it was. I don't think we would, heard it. Would Jason be upset if he lost his charger to his phone? Oh. So, we're going to answer. You three are going to answer. One. Two, three. No, no, no. There it is. No. Yeah, no. no. If I mean, everybody, some... everybody, the other three listeners, right, listening, they know. They already knew the answer. Yeah. If you had some of the apps I do, you would be upset. Mm. Oh yeah. I doubt it. Ben, grinder. Would he be up? <laughs> <laughs> That's why I didn't ask you. <laughs> are you into coffee making? Yeah, it's really good. It's, the aromas are amazing. Okay. <laughs> Tried his own nuts fresh. He's a, mm. oh. he's a coffee maker. Roast his own beans. <laughs> yeah. You do the, uh, the Grinder civets beans. beans? The who? The, uh, they're, um, they're like the most expensive coffee beans in the world. They make the best coffee. And they, I don't remember if it's Colombia. Anyways, the seeds fall down. This cat eats them. I think it's a civets. Shits them out. And then those are collected. And something about those beans going through the digestive process of the cat, it makes the best, you know, like mutually agreed on best coffee in the world. I heard of that on the Bob and Tom show, actually. I uh, know. Mm. And I just... Cat, cat shit coffee. Yeah, no. Yep. My favorite coffee is... Jamaican blue, I think is what it's called. Yeah, man. It it was smooth. I mean, it was the smoothest coffee I've ever had. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, I don't like coffee. I wish I, I did. I got to be in the mood for it. It's not something that I would say it's three times a month, unless I'm having peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Dip it in there, but mm. just to drink a cup of coffee. I had that this morning. Peanut butter and coffee. Mm. Peanut butter and coffee mm-hmm. and all that. Mm. I love the like, smell of coffee, but I, that bitter aftertaste, I yep. can't do it. I, you uh, put some sugar in there. I've tried. Put more sugar in there. Creamer. <laughs> yeah, I got some creamer for you. Yeah. <laughs> a little thirsty. Speaking bit. of creamer, Nate, Nate still has to finish his night out. Oh, today. that's right. <laughs> uh, night out. Thing. Well, that was what, yeah. So I went up there and did that. Um, that was Tuesday, Wednesday. I don't, I'm sure I did something. Probably went fishing. No, no. That's usually once a summer. <laughs> way to get it out of the way. Yeah, get out of the way. It's already <laughs> August. It's going to snow tonight, you already said. Down to 57. Um, nice. Windows open. Yes. Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday, Wednesday. I don't think, I don't know what I did. Whopper um, Wednesday. Yeah. Um, and then uh, DoorDash. Thursday. Um, DoorDash. Last night. No, yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> Uh, no, last night I didn't. Uh, last night I didn't. I didn't have dinner last night. I was Uber. Too, I was working on this damn computer. Yeah. Since we fired the tech guys, I was down here from the time I got home five o'clock until well, I ran down to Best Buy to grab the the RAM and stuff and come back and then I was back down working down here till nine thirty. Was the tech guy pretty pissed or no? He just packed the shit and left. Did he? Yeah. He's packed the, your shit and left? No. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. Uh, Ayo, Good one. there it is. Mm. Whoopsie, whoopsie. <laughs> wow. Um, <laughs> yeah, no, so then I was doing that all, I mean, that consumed my Thursday, and then, yeah, that was the end of that. Cool. cool. Um, but I was going to say, though, about the coffee, I had gone over to a festival and they have the this Cameron's coffee that's like just the brand or whatever. But they have a whole shelf like multiple shelves full of this different coffees. So I'd picked up for the office, I picked up a dark chocolate mocha coffee. But I saw they have uh uh old fashioned uh, like brandy old fashioned coffee coffee beans there. Or really? like is one of the coffee flavors. I haven't tried it, but I just as long as it's it Southern there. Comfort. 
Brandy. That's what I was kind of wondering brandy if it's going off of that. I don't know. Southern Comfort. So is that like for the Keurig? No. Well, no. we ha- no, we have, I guess we, I didn't know this. They probably this. have a barista that comes in. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he comes in dollars. in the <laughs> Yeah, he gets there around six to start getting stuff set up and ready for us. And nice. Then, you know, and nice. I get in. Mm. No, we right just in. have a regular twelve cup coffee pot. Twelve cup or yeah, we drink a lot of coffee. No, um, yesterday it was about three o'clock. And <laughs> what was that? <laughs> wow, <laughs> is that you? Maybe. Yeah. Jeez. Yeah. Your clock inner, it's my alarm. Inner clock going <laughs> off, <laughs> inner something. Wow. Hmm. Anyway, no, it was about three o'clock or so yesterday, and I'm like, I am done with this day, but I couldn't be done with the day because I had things I still needed to do. Yeah, work. So I went across the parking lot to the little gas station there and got sixteen, seventeen dollars worth of candy. I said, if we're going to make it through the rest of this day, we need some candy. <laughs> At three o'clock? Oh At three o'clock in the afternoon. That's How late do you work? Another hour of your day. 4.30. 4.30? An oh. hour and a half? Another hour and a half? Yeah, but, I don't know. Just push through. Yeah, but it wasn't, I mean, I thought it would be kind of a nice little thing and bring everyone over. Oh, some, it was, I thought, it was I took that it as it was just yourself. for me. No, shit. Same, no, yeah. No, 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 oh. no. You didn't door dash that? No, it's across the parking lot. Plus, I got to get out and get a couple puffs on the vape. And, oh, my God. I'll <laughs> we'll have to get a policy changed. Good luck. <laughs> so, okay, good. Go ahead. Is so that yeah, it? Is that all you got? Well, well Monday got. morning at five o'clock, I'm about ready for the week to be over with. So, <laughs> don't I'm you glad start you can at make it a.m. or p.m. Five a.m. Don't you start at five? Yeah. Good, well, good. it's been lately. It's been between three thirty and four a.m. I was gonna say. Oh, I hope it's earlier than five. Yeah, so we got a good hour and a half. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna What's have his P and J's sandwich. Mm-hmm. I usually get up about two fifty. That's gotta stop, man. You're telling me. <laughs> yeah. Well, and if you don't work till five, what do you do for two hours before work? No, I. S- oh, he's done with the week by five. Yeah, oh. he oh. puts a good hour and a half in and shuts her down. Oh, oh yeah, just That's coast, enough. coast yeah. through it. I don't know. Mm. I'm out, bitches. Yep. yep. So since the Olympics are ending today, <clears throat> did you know they gave the Olympians three hundred thousand condoms? Yeah, you talked about that last week. That got uh, cut off. I think, yeah, our tech crew oh, cut it, it off. Oh, yeah. Why? Yeah. Sorry. Why what? Condoms? Yeah, for fucking. Mm, yep, for fucking. What the hell? What is a condom? Some of them are married. Um, apparently, I don't think it they're was each. Or, yeah, no, not each. But <laughs> oh, I thought okay. <laughs> no, they're they handed out three hundred thousand condoms to the Olympians. Oh, that just sounds like a fuck fest. <laughs> it always is. <sighs> I start training next week. <laughs> <laughs> what events are you going to be in? All of them. All of them? Yeah. Mm. All events. I don't got to be good. I, I'm not going for gold for all of them. You got to be pretty good just to get there. Yeah, they have break dancing. We'll Where figure something out. I would love to see you in the that break was on today. competition. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Damn. Last night we watched some trampoline. I didn't know that was an event. Trampoline is an Olympic event? Uh-huh. Were they ju- on, was it long and narrow? Yeah, they, instead of a round, the in ground yeah. one. Yeah, or no. Um, those fuckers get high. On yeah, I can't remember if they had to climb up onto it or not. But yeah, they. It's basically like a combination of gymnastics floor routine. Yeah, and the trampoline. Like they they get up super high and they're doing flips and yeah, awesome. spinny things. That's a technical term, I think. And it spinny sure things. Yep. Watch sure. some of that, and I I have been meaning to watch the kayak cross so i mm. watched some of that last night that's pretty fucking cool. i seen that, that the other day cool. yeah. they have to do a barrel roll in yeah the water. Oh, yeah. That it's cool. it's just crazy chaos yeah and that's a, obviously it's a man-made what do we call it what do they call it is it a river creek? yeah it's what like do they a call set it? of rapids yeah basically. i mean it's obviously there's engineering and turbines oh, yeah. and shit in there but yeah it looked like let's on the just side, take them to though, the flamble it looked like on the side they could stuff in and change the way the water oh, flow and i'm sure because like they that. probably that course is probably used for multiple things would be yeah. my guess you know yeah. like that a lazy river sense. yeah yeah you know after the fact it's a lazy river 
Yes, well, Nate? I was just thinking this conversation of the Olympics kind of leads us into some of our, uh, at least a an email that we received. Wait, a what? Oh. An email that we received, and actually... Um, this I didn't hear anything. You got your headphones on? Check. Check. I got mail! Oh, there Yay, it is. I got <laughs> mail! Oh, okay. Yay! Must, the connection must have been loose. Oh, okay. I heard it now. Yeah, you got to screw loose. Um, I have an older phone than Jason, so it takes a little bit of time <laughs> there. I have more than two apps on my phone, so. Just a home screen, back screen, home screen, back screen. Um, Where are the kids? So th- it's kind of. Ants. It's kind of. Um, Refresh. <laughs> not, I'd say not ironic because we were going to talk about it last week, and I believe that we did. But uh, we had just got an email, actually. This was. 30 minutes ago, so Ooh. it was while we were recording. Fresh. Awesome. Wow. This Hot. is, this is uh, with oh. Olympics coming to an end, did you hear about the pole vaulter that lost because yes. he has a big D plus? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the size of that. Wang, Dude. pay attention. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, did he really lose? And they say size doesn't matter. You know, I was looking at that the other day because when you mentioned that, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't see that, you know. So I, it's on uh, YouTube. And oh, I, yeah. That's a hog, dude. Yeah, yeah, it's a big hog. And as that scene, this was attached to the email. Uh, he was offered two hundred and fifty thousand yep. dollars. Yeah, there he is to show it. Look at that thing to show his hog. Yeah, on a cam show. Yeah, two hundred and fifty thousand dollars to get that thing out of his pants right there. Done, 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 and done. What did he say? Uh, I don't know. He it didn't say in the article. He speaks French. I don't know. I don't understand French. Oui. The oui. wife and I were talking about that, and she's like, that thing is fucking huge. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, I know. <laughs> and I said, if you watch the video, as he's coming down, he actually hits the pole with his shins. Yep. yep. It, yep. And that's what causes it to bounce. And then uh, she's like, you're ruining my fantasy. Uh, All I need to know <laughs> is that his huge schlong knocked down the pole. But even though after he did hit it with his schlong, yeah. Yeah, that thing just sits there and wiggles and flops around. The pole or the schlong? His schlong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking Good. draft horse up there. No yeah. shit. Yeah. Yeah. When things like that happen, it makes me think that I would be a good pole vaulter then, because I ain't gonna worry about that. Because you'd hit your shins. No, I wouldn't have to worry about that. Oh. I'd, I'd clear <laughs> clear right over. That guy's nickname is BDJ, <laughs> Big yeah. Dick Jacques. Yeah, no uh, true. Actually, meaning. I think his first name is Anthony. Is it? I yeah. thought it said something about Jacques. Anthony. Oh, <laughs> Jacques. <laughs> <laughs> BDA then. Yep. Um, let's see. Group. We got here. a Reddit page for that. I'm sure. <laughs> How about you four play a couple rounds of cards against humanity? Oh. Mm. Some cards might get you banned on some platforms. Or maybe our new tech crew can beep some words if we if, need to. If Urban Dictionary if, yeah. didn't get us banned, that's right. pretty yeah, safe. Yeah. Of course, it didn't get us sponsors either, so I don't know where we, yeah. where we lie with I think that. We, got some, uh, we well, probably ended up... There's biased thing. It's belt looping. Fuck them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Chad's going to have a belt looping contest at, at the next He's got a belt looping out. function later. <laughs> 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 a function. Hopefully not a malfunction. Uh, so. uh, um, ripped him right off his pants. <laughs> totally be willing to open up our backyard, smoke our grill, and play with us adults in our safe space. I like that. that hey, is. live. Come, Come alive. In the safe space. From the backyard in the safe space. Space, space. <laughs> <laughs> My safe word is avocado. <laughs> yeah. Strawberry. I can't, I can't say that. <laughs> That's the point. Um... Hey, Hicks, keep up the great Hello. work. These episodes are great to listen to while driving, mowing the lawn, or just relaxing on the bucket. Yeah, absolutely, oh, it is. Yep. You have started a movement in, in a couple <laughs> different in couple more different ways, ways than one. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'd like to comment on the time travel scenario. Hmm. While everyone wanted to go see or experience a time or event or do something to enrich themselves, Eliminate the Baby Fuhrer was also mentioned. On its face, this seems like a fantastic idea. However, nature abhors... Horse. 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 Yeah. horse. horse. You know what a horse says. No. Nate. <laughs> um, 
I just wanted you to say horse. Uh, a va- uh, nature abhors a vacuum, and what or who would replace Adolf? Remember the situation that allowed that POS to ascend to power would still be in place with or without him. You could get someone worse just as likely as someone better. Uh, Gobels. Gobels. Sounds French. Um, or no, that's German, I suppose. Yeah. Yes. Hi. <clears throat> Hi. <laughs> um, you also had a leader that was actually worse than Hitler, yet an ally to us during World War II. Stalin killed more people than Hitler and was arguably more sadistic in his methods. He hated Jews too and pretty much everyone else. Just ask the Polish. And lastly, the short story, A Sound of Thunder is about the butterfly effect, which is also a movie about the same phenomenon. (laughs) Even a small change in events can cause enormous changes in the future. If you haven't read it, I do recommend it as they go back in time and hunt dinosaurs. Now, if I could time travel, that would definitely be on my bucket list. Thanks again for the thought-provoking topics. I'm already eagerly awaiting the next episode. Episode, episode. So how would they hunt dinosaurs back then? They take that long javelin thing javelin, and like, sure. is that how they that just bring that pole vaulter with the huge hog? Ah, oh. <laughs> whips hog. it out and they fucking they're done. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Andrew Jacques. Yeah, it's like beating him with twenty four sacks of nickels. Good lord. <laughs> Hung like a dinosaur. Uh, really enjoy your podcast and look forward to hearing this week's topic. Keep up the good work. And Jason, may I suggest mm-hmm. lavender scented bags? The smell is very mm-hmm. calming in case you should mm-hmm. see the spider again. Shitting That fucking spider was huge, boys. Yeah, yeah, I'll heard. tell you that right now. <laughs> uh, mm-hmm. <laughs> It was. It was large. It was a pole vaulter size. <laughs> really? Yeah. It was a yeah. pole vaulter. I don't even think it was as big as a pole vaulter. You don't think so? No. You think he was bigger? Yeah. I was bigger. Yeah. You heard it here first. Yeah. Yep. Is that why you don't pole vault? That is exactly <laughs> why. <laughs> Plus, I'm scared of heights. And so. I, I, well, I'm <laughs> scared of heights. <laughs> Makes sense. The pole vault. Oh, well, they got to go well, like 20 feet in the air. I'm glad mm-hmm. I'm short. Sure. Yeah. Mm. That's all that's to that story. It should all be right. a jockey, horse jockey then. <sighs> They're st- what they stand awful high. That's they true. Do. Depends six on hands. hands. Six, yeah. six hands high. Yes. Um, Look at their big nostrils. Here's new. Nate, you can't be too hard on Chad for being on his phone while driving. He has to have Pornhub going to keep him <laughs> occupied on his long trips. Sorry, Chad, but you should have known something like that would be coming from me. Yeah, and they have audio only, so uh, you know it's not that big a deal. Don't worry, they're going to be outlawed here pretty soon, anyways. <laughs> they're what? Cell phones? Gonna be, no, Pornhub. Yeah. Uh, uh, were you saying that before? Yeah, they got banned in five states. Horseshit. I don't know if that got cut off last week or not, that I when think, we were talking about that. I think so. Yeah, it was banned we, in five states. Um, and the reason is because their age verification isn't stringent enough. Mm. Uh, yeah, no. Are you adult? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Apparently, you need more than are you over 18? Click yes. <laughs> Yeah, you know, soon we'll have to. Works be. for me on a system, right? Like, well, right. yeah. Or I just mean, find every picture that has a car or a stop sign in it. Right, that's pretty easy. Yeah. And if you can look at that and you know what you're looking at, whatever. You know, I hate the ones where it's like enter exactly as you see here, and half of them don't oh. actually look like a fucking letter. Yeah, yeah. and right. I'm just guessing. Yeah, is that an E or an yep. A? Or they're like smidged together or yeah. off the screen. Like what the fuck? Did yeah. I text this to them first? <laughs> it's like it's like I'm just really rolling the dice here. Did yeah. I get it right or not? I I don't know. Come on, just let me watch my porn. Right, yeah. right. right. I'm taking a quiz. Yeah, yeah. Just trying to make a statue sock here. Yeah, well, mm-hmm. one at a time. Mm-hmm. Um. Hey guys and BDC. Hey, Ooh, well, hello. BDC. With back to school approaching, I thought it would be interesting to hear all of those school days war stories. Hmm. Like, remember when you spilled your juice all over the girl you had a crush on, her art project in grade Mm -hmm. school? Mm -hmm. Or you had to wear a patch on your eye and you weren't allowed to go to recess because the kids would make fun of you? Mm -hmm. See, I never had an eye patch, but kids still made fun of me. Because you didn't have an eye patch, I'm sure. Maybe that's what it was. Yeah, I'm sure that's why. Huh. 
Um, Just look in the mirror. <laughs> I try to avoid it. <laughs> if your mom wasn't with you at school, I probably wouldn't think I <laughs> Why doesn't Nate always hang out with that with the school aid? That's, that's, school that's his aid. mom. Yeah. That's Mrs. Yeah. Lytle. Mm. <laughs> um. <laughs> Nate, come here. You got some boogies. <laughs> Ma. Oh. <laughs> trying to fucking read <laughs> yeah, just wait till dad and karen don't listen to this oh, at yeah. 7 p.m on sunday oh, yeah. morning. Yeah. fucking ben i swear to christ i'm gonna choke <laughs> yeah. him out the next time i see him i wish you would have stayed today i would have been uh, <laughs> just sat on the couch i'm gonna feed that fucker a whole plate full of onions, onions. <laughs> <laughs> fucking onions man take him out on for the sure day. for sure um are you still reading do they send a book in yeah I mean, what's um, going on? When you always thought the uh, when the other kids talked about Mary Jane, you thought they all liked Spider Man. This is why kids made fun of you, Kale the Whale. <laughs> Let's not forget about the time you were the only boy in the water aerobic gym class. And Ooh. thank God, if you forgot your trunks, they had speedos available. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah! Thanks, mom, for helping me pick classes. <laughs> uh, yeah. All right. P.S. BDC is going to stick. Yep. Okay. Well, this stick has been, it what, out. Three, three or so, three or four episodes now, so yeah. Yep. Still here. It's not going anywhere. No. Yep. I mean, what can I say? Huh. Lies. Please, please, please start a three-letter acronym test segment for Jason. It's in the works. We're Ooh. Hmm. That's going to be something. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so it was recommended uh, that we come up with our bios and put our bios on the website. Uh, apparently, people go to our website. Do you want to explain what that is to Jason? The three other people? A bio. Do you know what a bio is, Jason? No. A biography. <laughs> it's like something. Just Are you up, surprised, man? Write up a little That's paragraph about is yourself. Like a, is that like a resume? That's why I said explain two, that to Jason. Two, three sentences about yourself. <clears throat> tell, tell us a little bit about yourself. Is what In two is. or three sentences. Interest, family, uh, <clears throat> maybe your career. Very tech savvy. My name's Jason. I'm scared of heights. Mm-hmm. I don't like technology and fuck people who dye their hair. Yeah. I shit on a bucket. <clears throat> yep. Oh, yeah. I can't wait oh, yeah. that out. <laughs> yeah. I shit you on a bucket in my garage. In a garage. Yeah. That's I'm it. lactose intolerant. Yeah, <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Maybe it might oh, be. I'm Maybe lactose just be the intolerant, but I'll eat the shit out of some dairy. Yeah. 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 Well, cheese sometimes. Curds. Yeah, because sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, sometimes doesn't cheese curds them. don't bother me, but almost all the time they do. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh god, that was so funny. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, because I yeah I did what he said, and I go back and listen to some of the old ones sometimes too, and it's yep. Do you guys need some fucking hobbies? <laughs> <laughs> do it while we're working. Maybe you need to start working. Yeah, uh, I do. Yeah. If you weren't watching TV while you were driving, <laughs> you could be listening to podcasts. Yeah, that's yeah. true. My bad. Jesus, <laughs> I'll have to switch it up like every other day. You know, podcast. Chad's on a red Porn light Hub. watching Sports Center top ten. <laughs> Hang it! Everybody's honking because he has a pull away. <laughs> Hang on, we're almost to number one. <laughs> you just put the flashes on. <clears throat> that's true. I mean, you're I'm in, broke when you're, down when you're in a big truck. They don't they don't question it. Oh, I'm just going fucking around you. <laughs> Fuck them! I gotta start watching. Movies. I actually saw a video just maybe just today where there was a semi driving down the road and must have I don't know if he fell asleep or what he did, but he went off the side of the road to the right, brought her all the way back across the three lanes down into the median. Went it was down in there for a while, brought her back up, Jesus. got back up onto the highway with trailer still intact or whatever, and then just. Kept on going Fuck like nothing awesome. ever happened. Keep on moving. Yep. Yeah. Hang ten, dude. Yeah. Just surfing. I like it. Yeah. Hey. Might as well. I mean, what do you do? Stop and offer to reseed the lawn? No. Right. right. I just yeah. go. Just keep mm. going. Fuck. Yeah. I like it. Hammer right. down. Yeah. All right. Uh, should we do? Uh, well. Mm. Shall we? Yeah. Should we do some news? Yeah. News. We can do some news, and then I have a I found a new new subreddit that we should discuss. I do have a uh, one more email. Sorry, but this goes into our news. Uh, listening to ben, Ben's headline. Oh, wait, so listening to Ben's headlines and then Nate's Chuck Norris bit, it reminded me of an interesting research project. 
Oh. Florida man, dot, dot, dot. Oh, yeah. Then pick any random date and you will find a crazy, weird-ass headline. 100%. Don't know if they are true, but hey, it's uh, it's on the internet, so it must be, which is true. Yeah, obviously. True. Yeah, yeah. Right? And while they're good for a laugh and or a, uh, what the fuck. So, <laughs> yeah, that's uh, interesting. That could be something we could do. Maybe. That is a true thing, too. Yeah. Like, <clears throat> Florida the, man is some amazing shit to look at. Yeah. Weird shit happens down there. Yeah. <clears throat> so news. All gray hairs. You what? I thought they were all gray hairs down there. Not all of them. Oh, okay. no! Didn't we? I Definitely we communities had. for sure. Yeah, uh, that way though. Mm. Yeah, never been to Florida. No, you've never been to Florida. Well, once in '92, but okay, well, oh, that, that means you were there about a fucking hour, and we got, we got off got the on plane and went onto a boat, and that was it. See, we were Still doing there. we were doing the opposite of what normally happens to the people down there. But <laughs> they're usually getting off the boat. On. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're getting on the boat. <laughs> So, yeah, this first one isn't really news, but I saw this. uh, I'm assuming this, based on the language, I'm guessing it's Russia. They have an ass-slapping championship. Oh, really? Yeah. Is that your buddy that used to go out to the bars? No. No, this is all women. One out of... They slap each other's asses? Uh What? Oh. Yeah. And, I mean, I'm guessing they're Russian. She but I mean, they're s- that's, a, that's, nicer, that's yeah. a nicer ass. They're smacking the shit out of each other. Oh. Uh, can you just turn it? <laughs> no, don't do that. You get it? <laughs> oh, my God. Her ass was red. <laughs> yeah. No, you want to see this one, right? The one that's about to get slapped. That oh, he has to turn it. <laughs> Sorry, that's not very good radio. But anyways, you know, they have an ass slap in championship. We'll, we'll uh. watch that later for more research. Mm, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, research. <clears throat> research purposes. Yes. Uh, so I didn't even hear it. Yeah. Uh, a woman died after getting caught <laughs> in, a, in a baggage carousel at Chicago <laughs> Carry on. Airport. I heard that. I don't know how that happens. She oh, was well, in a restricted it. area. Yeah, because they said um, security footage caught her going in there at like 2 a.m. Mm-hmm. into a restricted area, and her body was found at like 7 o'clock. Yeah, 7 a.m. The only thing I could think is she got on and rode it back to like where the machinery was. Sorter or whatever, you know, like yeah, that. something. Yeah, and she there was a lady that uh, died in a baggage claim. Uh, uh, yeah, at O'Hare Carousel. Airport, mm. Chicago. Yeah, Chicago. Mm-hmm. Chicago. Yep. Uh, next one: a man was taking his trash to the dumpster, and apparently, while he was doing it, he was carrying a gun. <clears throat> slipped in his lawn, fell down, shot, and killed himself. Mm. Why do you need to carry a fucking gun to mom. take your trash out? Well, was it Chicago? The, yeah, where, it was just <laughs> Detroit. Saying, where? I mean, he lives in the city. It, I I read the article and they had a picture of this little tiny. I wouldn't even call it a hill. Um, a no. Like part of his grass sloped downwards, and that's where he slipped and shot himself. But like hmm. he lived in a city, it just looked like a neighborhood, like. So when he slipped, the gun <clears throat> accidentally Don't fired. And yeah, like he didn't or... kill himself on right. purpose. He yeah. fell and he didn't like slip and say "fuck," bang. No, he slipped and okay. the gun discharged and shot himself. Huh. Okay. <clears throat> so, but why you would need to carry a pistol? Hey. Well, unless it's just one of those guys that carries it wherever it you know, it's just sure. But, habit, you, but it could not have been in a holster. He had to have been holding oh, it in his true. hand. Yeah. You know. Hmm. You know. Yeah. Anyways. Hmm. Stupid. Yeah. So the Pennsylvania Supreme Court agrees to review a suicide ruling in a case where a woman was stabbed 20 times. <laughs> they ruled it a suicide. She died from 20 stab wounds. Self-conflicted. Yeah, they, they said it was a suicide. <clears throat> and they deemed it a suicide because the her apartment was locked from the inside and her boyfriend had to break down the door to get into the apartment. Sure he did. Uh-huh. After he stabbed her. Well, and he had no defensive wounds on him, so they deemed that he was innocent and it had to be a suicide. Couldn't have been anybody else in the world. Uh, Castle would, Castle would uh, Ten of the stab that. wounds were in the back of her neck. <laughs> That's Because who doesn't, I hate myself, and just start stabbing uh, yourself stabbing. in well, the back of the neck. After the first couple, how are you even... St- Precisely. Crystal and I were discussing this the other night. I'm like, how... People die... 
die in a lot of fucked up ways, and I've seen a lot of fucked up things of people killing themselves, but how do you stab yourself 20 times? Mm-hmm. I don't know. That seems, I'm not a detective by any means, but that yeah. seems far-fetched. Yeah, well, and that's, that's why her family has been pushing to get this case reopened. Yeah, it's Castle, I think it's on uh, I was listening nights. to a podcast. Now, not to keep going, but I was listening to another podcast. It's True true Crime. Yep. Mm-hmm. And... Uh, I was listening to that, and it's it's like a, comp- a conspiracy deal. Yep. Kind of. But people would just kind of go missing, right? Well, it's the police that are behind all this. Well, anyway, they found this guy who committed suicide. He shot himself three times <laughs> with a shotgun. Oh, holy shit. Sure, I could see that happening. Yep. And then... There yeah. was another one who had died from a gunshot wound or Lead whatever. Lead poisoning? Yep. And that was a, also a suicide. Or, well, it was claimed an, he died from an ulcer is what he claimed died oh. from is what it was. But when I, they had you found see him. what had happened was he got shot in the ulcer and he died. <laughs> but what had happened was he, he was dead in his house and his dog was yeah. chewing on his oh, head. Oh, fucking awesome. And his, so, but when oh. the, yeah, it's it, oh, it's a fucked up story. Chewed him enough to make it look like a gunshot wound. Yeah. Maybe that was it, yeah. But it was uh. a, he died from an ulcer is what had happened. Sure it is. Oh. Huh. Mm-hmm. Well, that, uh, hmm. I've heard of animals, usually it's cats that'll eat. That's if you die them. with cats, cats will eat you much sooner. And it, it's not even like, weeks it's days i mean that's why people don't have cats well, yeah no cats, that's terrible i'm not a cat person well, no cats are no. bastard <clears throat> cats are bastards yeah <clears throat> you guys used to have a cat didn't you fuck off <laughs> so that was like a yes or <laughs> I'm no i'm still salty about this this is Sorry. still upsetting to me wow what so you had happened? a cat did we talk about square pizza slices and i didn't know it i don't Wait, even you know had what's a cat? going on who's he there yeah. jason you had a cat where at the house like a real old, uh, oh, in Chippewa, yeah, the one by the where you live old now. folks home no yeah, we're oh <coughs> oh we what? i thought you were we did yeah we, we had one yeah that's what the fuck we're asking that's he's, not what i was asking no that's not what he's yeah asking. that's you, what i was jason lytle was, had a cat yeah yeah mm, two of them at that house that was down the road from the old folks home yeah yes okay Irvine street oh. or yeah. something see i thought you were digging at a different story yeah well, the, that's why i was confused how he knew they had a cat but he, he was clueless they had a cat yeah no i was i thought you were talking about a story where i used to live where you live now yeah okay when you were yeah. a kid with your mom and dad yeah yeah well, I mean, yeah and then the cat. the cat was found under the back yeah. port. <laughs> <laughs> he's upset. He's laughing. Well, it was upset. The cat was dead. Was it your cat to start with? Yeah. I mean, it was... Um, yeah, I mean, it was a family cat, I suppose. So you fed it, you watered it, you played with the cat. Yeah. Do you really play with a cat? I don't pet, know. Pet the kitty. I don't pet know. the kitty. I have a neighbor lady that brings her cat out and Nuzzin? puts it on a goddamn <laughs> leash. The nuzzin. The nuzzin. <laughs> That's the lady. <laughs> That's not a cat. <laughs> That's not a cat. No. I don't know. <laughs> Looks like a kitty to me. She just takes the rollers out of her fucking cunny hair. That <laughs> 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 looks like she's taking a kitty for a walk. <laughs> Hairball. Fucking <laughs> yeah. <Getting> pussy perm. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Pussy perm. Put it on a t shirt. <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> you know thinking about that story that what, what? i, I want to think the cat snuck out of the house is what happened it was winter time yeah and at the time now we have a patio on on the back side of the garage there but at the time we didn't have a patio we just had like a wooden like porch a deck. A porch thing yeah, like porch but it was low it only was maybe six inches off the ground yep. you know and uh, the cat snuck out. That was when Mario was Mario, around. yeah, because he, <coughs> he had brought yeah he brought the story up again years and years later. Uh, yeah, it's well, a story anyway, that just doesn't go away. It yeah, and the cat must have snuck out or whatever in the winter, and we never found it till 
the spring, March, April, when oh, it started uh, on thawing and stinking, and Mario's mm. like, what is that smell? Like, sure, shit, there was mm. a cat we'll under the porch, yeah. Yeah, so in well, here, found it. but here's how it went then, okay. is Mario goes, Nathan, we found your cat. And I was pretty excited. <laughs> <laughs> and he's, I can see it's dead. <laughs> <laughs> then you weren't so excited. Then it was. Then the excitement left, and it hasn't returned. Oh. That was. Were you? You guys were in high school, right? When Mario was here. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, I probably was in middle school, but yeah. Well, the first time, yeah. Right. I mean, when he was here, school wise. Yeah, yeah living here. I think it's our turn to go <laughs> down there. I'm ready. He, yeah, he was here. Well, I knew that. I remember you guys having a cat in that house, Jason. Yeah. Um, the one in in Chippewa there. Yeah. Because I was over at your house one time for something, and I was sitting in a chair. You had a recliner or a chair, like kind of in the corner, by where you walked into the kitchen, and I had my arm hanging over the side of the chair, and the cat took a swipe at my hand, and it hit my hand, and of course I jerked my hand away. And I ripped its claw right out of its oh. freaking oh. paw. It was embedded in my finger. That's the cat's fault. And yeah, the cat's lucky it ran because I would have <laughs> fucking, I might have punted that thing. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Hmm. I guess it, I don't remember. Is it a pussy punt then? Pussy punt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Puss punt. <laughs> so anyway, it's okay. Back to news. All right. Yeah. It's enough kitty talk. Yeah. <clears throat> so I had the well, we already discussed the French pole vaulter, and then uh, <clears throat> I thought this was kind of funny. Uh, host of a Fox News show or some some show on Fox, <clears throat> this Laura Ingram was talking about politics, and she goes, her quote was, "If you know Minnesota, and I know it well, especially Milwaukee." It's changed in recent years. Wow. Like, yeah, you know it well. Yeah, nailed it. Wow. Yeah, yeah, nailed it. So that was all the news that I had. That's awesome. But my new Reddit that we should discuss. Mm. So anybody who's listened, if you really want to get an education, or maybe people already knew about this, I did not know that this was a thing. <clears throat> so there's a subreddit called Sounding. S O U N D I N G sounding. And you'd think, oh, maybe it has something to do with sound. No, it certainly does not. Does it happen to have um, 99,000 members? Uh, let me look. Yeah, 99.8K. Holy fuck. Yeah. That's uh, so. Let me let me read the description here. <laughs> I seen one uh, picture. Yeah. Oh, watch that video. I don't. I seen what it is. Uh, I'm not. Yeah. I did not know that this was a thing, and I was honestly, it's the most disturbed I've been in a while by the internet. <sighs> is this on Google? No. It's on no. Reddit. Oh, okay. Sounding is the practice of inserting objects into the urethra which is the hole in the end of your wang, for sexual and or mental pleasure. When practiced correctly, it can give all sorts of nice feelings and safe play is absolutely encouraged. Blah, 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 blah. Not a fucking leg bolt. Yeah. So that's, this Reddit is all videos and pictures of guys. This is, the, Chad, you got to scroll down to the next video. You got to watch this one. Scroll down and watch that. That looks like a ten penny nail or something. Oh, it's a bolt. Uh, that one. Watch that. Unfucking believable. What the fuck just, is it? Uh, just watch. It's holding the thing in. What? He had that thing in there for five hours. He said. What the fuck is it? Watch. It just keeps coming and coming and coming. This guy is pulling this long uh ribbed what the fuck? like piece of rubber out of the end of his unit <clears throat> hmm 5 hours yes cuz that's what that pink contraption is is it holds, holds it, it in, in there that's disturbing yeah i don't i don't think i'm going to be trying this <gasps> oh, no, no. no. This yeah is... no huh like I said, that was the most disturbed I've been in a while looking at the internet. I thought I'd seen some shit, and then 
The internet's undefeated, though. Just when you think nothing can surprise you. Right. Um, there comes that. Yeah, I won't be on that one. Shoving stuff in the end of your wainer. No, thank you. Mm-mm. That's definitely an exit only. Mm. Hmm. <clears throat> Chad's digging deep, though. He's no, digging. I'm reading the comments. Yeah, yeah I know. Oh, you're, yeah. You're, no you're, you're digging deep. Uh, I get it. Chad, um, later on tonight, Chad's going to have a fucking barn spike just so, sliding her in. So, unfortunately, there's a l- lot of comments on here. There's not one that is upset with it, like I am, or oh, they're concerned. in this community. Yeah, they're impressed, probably. Yeah, how do I get a flat cage like that? A okay. what? I don't, that's what that pink thing was. It's called a flat cage. Huh? If I see that on anybody's Christmas list, I'm not getting that. <laughs> huh? That thing was like a foot long. Maybe he's. Well, I mean, your your Aretha does travel. Up into your your bladder body, obviously, you know. Maybe, so. maybe the guy is a French pole vaulter. <laughs> Who, uh, knows? Who no. knows? It's actually no. I should have quit reading, but yeah, it is the beginning, or, or just quit talking. <laughs> it's the beginning <laughs> stage to a larger set to come. Mm. Yeah, because their goal is to get wider and wider. So this is like putting the like gauge the things thing in, in the ears. Ear. In the ears. Oh my god, I hate that. Oh, I hate that. This that, is terrible. To me, that, I was just going to say, that's Nate's hair dye. That's the hair dye to me. Yeah. The gauge is, Gaging oh, that's a, nope. Don't even, I, nope. <laughs> so anyways, don't, all you listeners out there. Don't need uh, that. Check it out. Educate yourself. Send us an email. Let you know. Let us know what you think about that. Well, yeah, good luck. All right. Speaking of emails, yes. let's move on to yes, a please. little more family uh, friendly. Let's get out of this. Um. The last few weeks we've been having a, <laughs> we've been having a deal contest for this for year, the mug for this for coffee the mug. mug. So big I, money, no whammies. We're gonna do this on the. We're gonna give that away. Oh. Chad's got. Look at that. He's he's trying to. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. So see how that. If we oh, there go it is. here, look at there. Now, so we have spin the wheel of spin destiny. Spin that wheel. Um, we go through the names of the people that we have on there because the people that aren't watching aren't going to be able to see this. Correct. Uh huh. Um, You're missing oh. a name, aren't you? I don't know. Who am I missing? Uh, Ryan. Oh. Uh, Holy fuck! Get your shit together, tech guy. I thought hey, we fired the tech guy. This is my first day on the job. That, oh. That's the one I sent you the Facebook yep, message. Yep, yep, yep. Did uh, um, Dave put in or no? I didn't see one. I didn't no. either. Well, I don't see the emails, obviously. Yeah, I didn't but, see yeah. an email. He um, may not have since he's won already. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, and he doesn't probably drink coffee. So we well, could put anything in there. It's a cup. All right, so here we have Kale. It's made for coffee, Nathan. Kale A, Kelly B, Caleb P, Chris W, Rachel J, Chris L, Carly B, Michael M, Dara L, Chris C, and Ryan M. Carly B, isn't she a singer? No, that's, that's Cardi B. Oh, she's got that wop. Oh, I heard that song. <laughs> I rem- That's a wet ass yeah mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. kitty um that kelly beatus daughter told me that song she said here listen to this i'm like what in uh, the fuck is this song <laughs> i'd never heard it before i didn't really? hear it ever since you, you know replay uh, it? that came no. out around the time when that one christmas song was outlawed yeah, baby it's cold outside yeah we got this wet ass pussy song yeah talking yep. about beat it up smack it right the whole nine yards yep, yep. but baby it's cold outside is oh uh, you know I that like that song yeah. game it's uh, because they're talking about how it's he's, unwanted advances. He's trying to persuade her to stay <laughs> against her wishes, yeah. so to speak, uh. so that things can happen. Apparently, <sighs> I don't, it's he's just looking out for her safety. Yeah, it's cool. Hold outside. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Should we spin this thing? Why don't you spin, spin the wheel of destiny? The wheel. <sighs> and the winner is holy. And we are going to Michael M. Hey, M and M. Michael M. Michael M. 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 We have a winner. BDM in the house. (laughs) BDM winner. (laughs) Winner every time. (laughs) There you go. So that coffee mug goes to Michael. 
Thank you, Michael. Mm, next yes, week we will you. start a new. Uh, we'll start a new one next week. So. Yeah, next. Yeah, um, that one will probably just ship out in a Ziploc baggie, and however you get it, you get it. Yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Seems fair. Yeah. yeah. What? It didn't say it was coming in one piece. Yeah. That's true. Just because that's what it no, looks like now. Well. Right. Yeah. It's a coffee mug puzzle. Put it together. <laughs> with yeah. super glue. Enjoy. Yeah. We'll send the glue in. Yeah. Right. Hmm. No, we won't. No, we won't. <laughs> Some assembly required. There you go. Yeah. Nice. Hey, uh, one real quick thing. Um, He's still on that Reddit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like my mind. I'm, I'm uh, shocked. I mean, like you said, the internet won. Uh, it's undefeated. Yeah. It. Uh, yeah. Do we have time? How much time have we got? Or how, are we much, done? how much time do you want? As much as you want. I don't Chad, know. We we run this shit. Yeah. Uh, We're uh, the tech crew. I now, think Jason so. knows. Jason's probably going to win this one, but um, it was just a conversation we had at our last meeting. Um, on time to work. Do you guys? Are you yourselves? Are you a person? If you work at seven, are you getting there at six fifty eight? Are you getting there at 6.45? Or are you going to be one of those guys that are at 6.15, knowing damn well you can't punch in until 5 to 7? Are you going to sit there for a half hour, 45 minutes to well, acclimate yourself? Or When I was a smoker, <clears throat> I'd get there half hour to an hour before my shift would start, and I would just sit out at this picnic table and smoke a couple cigarettes and bullshit because there were several other guys who did the same thing yeah and we'd sit outside and shoot the breeze and have a couple smokes and then you know go in and start work or whatever but now that i'm not i'm still there at least a half hour early i mean i don't punch a clock anymore i'm salaried but like i'm always there yeah yeah early i i would say i'm in i'm at work a 20 a good 20 minutes Give or take a minute or two, you know. But on average, I would say it's 20 minutes before my shift. Hmm. Mm, 3.30 is pretty much 3.30. <laughs> so, I mean, you start... 3.45 you can... is 3.45 is when I get... Because that's pretty fucking early. But... <laughs> yeah. So, it's just pretty much when I get there, I clock in, you know. So, you so, don't you don't sit there and wait till 4 is what you're getting at. No. Well, it depends, you know. Sometimes... You get tired, you know, especially till the, towards the end of the week. You're dragging pretty good, you know. So sometimes, yeah, it might not be till four o'clock. You but know, technically, your shift up. doesn't actually start till what five? Five. So right, you're still you're. It's just you're not working as much overtime as you could. Is all that boils down to? You're still there super early. Well, no, I get there and I start work right away. Right, but I'm saying like so. I'm instead doing of like starting at three thirty, you're starting at four. Right. It's still all over time. Yeah, so it's 44 yeah. hours. Yeah. I'm working. Right. You know, yeah, I could go on on Fridays, but if 44 hours isn't enough, 44, 45, yeah. maybe find another person, you know. Yeah, hire an extra worker. Yeah, get another yeah. guy. Then I can do 40, <laughs> you know, because then they'll take up the other slack that yeah. needs to be done. Hmm. You know. Saving the company money, not overtime. Then sure. there you go. Yeah, and I don't necessarily have a starting time per se either. I'll say I aim for seven o'clock to be at work. Some days it's ten two. Some days it's ten after. Some days it's eight. But that's I mean, so that it, that goes to like if you had to be there at seven, are you there at? Ten uh, two because five. you're there. Like when you used to work at Mason Shoe and you had to be there at yeah maybe five ten minutes early. Okay, because I see a lot of or most of the time I've in through my years I've seen a lot of people that are I would say a, a ten minutes or more mm-hmm. prior to the shift. Oh yeah, this job. That my last job was like that. That's how I I was always early, probably a half an hour twenty minutes maybe, always early just to get my fucking mindset get coffee going. Sure. Yeah. You know, for everybody else and have a, some famous Amos cookies or something, sure. you know, but now it's not like that no more. This job, and I'm there earlier, but this job, there are, I would say, more than 50% of them, uh, if they have to punch in at 6, it's 559.55. 59. 
four. Nine. Yeah. Six so, seconds just to yep. be on the safe side. Yep. I, I just I don't I can't get on board with that. Are they like yeah. under twenty five years old, maybe? No, they're all different ages. Oh really? Oh fuck. One guy's only got I think twelve twelve working days left. And so he, like when well, I Oh Yeah, maybe, but no, it's not. like that's his like, when, like like when I was at the CC and I was punching the clock before I became salaried, like if when I I almost always work second shift, right? So your shift starts at three. So if unless you were approved for overtime, like you can't work overtime, right? right? Mm-hmm. So you know, like in, we were always busy, so usually you could do overtime. But like, say you you weren't working overtime, you couldn't punch in more than. Eight minutes yep, early, yeah. I think it was. I was at a place where it was seven. seven yeah, it's, it was so many minutes yep. before three, right? Yep. And then it rounded back. Otherwise, you were getting fifteen minutes of overtime. Right. Okay. Yep. That's so, how it is where I'm at. Yeah. So like most of the time, I would you know hang out in the break room or you know outside burning one with the guys or whatever, and then it's like oh, okay, it's it's six two. I'd go in and punch the clock, and then you go and stand by your by the 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 hallway or the entrance to the floor but you couldn't actually start walking to the floor until the bell rang because everybody's driving around on forklifts mm. so it's it's they deemed it not to be safe like it used to just be a free-for-all you know and and at quarter to three o'clock or shift change it was a fucking you had to have your head on a swivel right because there's people in forklifts all over the place. So, mm-hmm. But then they changed it so when that bell hit 3 o'clock, you made your walk back to your department. And Perfect. that way all the forklifts were parked or whatever, and, you know, it was safer. But, yeah. I'm always, I, If I have to be anywhere at a set time, I'm always at least 15 minutes early. Perfect. All right, I was just hmm. curious. It's just something I picked up noticing a lot of seconds prior to fucking Ooh, we're going to be done okay. <laughs> but before we're done so, um i gotta ask what your hat says no regrets <laughs> oh, no regrets okay because not even one letter my I, that's my credo <laughs> from here i could see uh I, I was reading it out as no regrets which is a gary allen song i thought maybe you were doing yeah paying no. homage because uh, <laughs> uh you guys know next week that's where i'll be I'll have so much next week. I don't know. I mean, you guys want to take the week off or whatever. I could just sit and talk an hour about the show. That no one cares. You see our rating spike. Boom. Through the roof. Yeah, by one. You're right. Spike. Anyway. Um, you better throw a t-shirt up, a t-shirt up on stage. Did uh, you see He's the, throwing his panties up on stage. Uh, oh, the thing. Yeah, bro. <laughs> I did get a new shirt. Gary! I did get a new shirt for the show. He knows he's hearing him because he's the only one in the audience. <laughs> yes, Nate, how's it going? <laughs> I miss you, Gary. Have my butt, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. <laughs> what kind of T-shirt did you get? It was Gary Allen watching airplanes. I'll bring. I'll show you guys. Watching airplanes. Sure. Is that, that is a song. Pretty, yeah, it is a pretty good song. See. <laughs> You've actually heard some of his music? I have. I've actually seen this guy. Huh. You've been to a show? I have, over in Treasure Island. Was it at, like, Woolworths, Treasure Five Island. and Dime, where they open up a new <laughs> f- franchise? <laughs> yeah. It was, you know how some bathrooms, um, when they're cleaning them or you're using them, has that background music? Oh, yeah. yeah. That was him live. <laughs> huh. Yeah. So that little tiny store could afford to have Gary Allen just come in and play music random well it's been another good week um, that's crazy i, I just huh. yeah that's all cool. right so congratulations to michael for winning the mug we'll make sure that gets up to you guys <laughs> he doesn't want to hear it no more no <laughs> mm. oh you guys have been on mute for the i've learned uh, we're talking you, about oh, your yeah. your yeah. love interest you're oh. fucking <laughs> you guys you have been and on, gary are simpatico you guys have been on mute so it doesn't you're matter. two musketeers and a one musketeer pod i mean <laughs> I, I get it uh, congratulations, Michael. Uh, winning the mug. Ready to go, Make Michael. sure uh, you guys right. listen next week. We'll have a new Prize. thing to give away. Cool. Nate will be uh, having fucking contest. statue socks stacked up to the ceiling oh, after watching over. fucking Woo. Gary Allen yeah. in yes. concert. All right. Again. Coming to you live from Dick's Tire Change Station. 
<laughs> All right. Let's go watch some Rough and Rowdy. Hey, All there. All right. You guys have a good week. Uh, you Later. Too. All right. All right. All right. Sorry, mate. Boat came over this table. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to see.